Hello everyone, welcome to another Framer tutorial video. Now in this Framer tutorial video, I will show you how to add custom download button in Framer. Now I'll also show you how to link it as well. Before we get started, you can get a free Framer account with a link down below. You can get up to three months free on a premium plan. And you can also get 25% off on a yearly subscription on Framer on premium plan as well. So uh, let's get started. So first of all, what you want to do is you want to go and open up a uh, new project here in Framer. Now, once we have a new project, uh, we'll use this code right here. So this code is, by the way, from this creator right here. So just make sure to visit his channel if you want more coding tutorials or you know more stuff like this, but this is his code. So we'll basically go and just copy this core code here. We'll copy the code and we'll go to the framer and we'll go to the assets and we want to go to the code section. So once you go to the code section, just make sure to name this download button, for example. We can create this and we can just go and go and CMD all or control all and then just paste here this code. We want to hit save and this is how it's going to look like right here as you can see. So that's what we have here. Obviously, this code can be changed with the margin here, the padding, the border radius as well. You can change the border radius here. So as you can see now, it has uh, more border radius. We can also change the width and height and also the bold and you know font size if you want. For example, 1 a.m. right here, we can change it like that and it will be like this. So obviously, we want to keep it too. So once we save this, we can go to the home and as you can see, now we have this right here and we can just go and we can just drag and drop it here. As you can see, we have it here. We can click on it. And now what we can do is we can choose a file that we want to uh, basically, whenever someone goes and clicks on this link, uh, they will download this file. So you can choose a file here. And as you can see, I'll, for example, do this file here. Now, once someone clicks on it, uh, that file will be pretty much downloaded. So if we go to publish, and if we publish this to this right here, as you can see, once we, someone clicks on this, you know, they will be brought to that file. So that's pretty much how you can um, add a download button in Framer. Obviously, if you have any more questions, comment down below. Um, definitely check out this person because he provided us with the code. And obviously, uh, if you want a free Framer account, and up to three months on premium subscription on Framer and 25% off on a yearly subscription on Framer, check out our link down below as well as the code uh, for that down below. Thank you guys for watching.